All right, guys, bad news just broke. Carson Wentz, done for the year. Um, you know what? It's bittersweet that we won the division because we just lost our, we just lost our QB. But for somehow, some reason, in some way, now that Carson Wentz got injured at this point, it's a little bit of a blessing in disguise because we could get Nick Foles ready for the next five weeks. And Nick Foles has some playoff experience. I know I sound delusional. I know I sound like I'm in denial. But what else can we do? There's nothing to do. This team is still going to the playoffs. We still need to perform. We still have a shot. We really do. Our offense changes a little bit now. All right? Obviously, you don't have the mobility with uh, Carson that you do with um, Foles or the other way around. But Foles is a pure pocket passer. If you give him some time, he can make some quality throws like you saw yesterday. We have Jay Ajayi, which we haven't used that much. We have LeGarrette Blunt, two Pro Bowl running backs. If you switch the offense up, this proves what kind of coach Doug Peterson is now. This team is all Doug Peterson now. If this guy can make this offense run in a winning form without their star QB, I mean, pound the ball, pound the ball, pound the ball. Make throws when you need to. You don't necessarily have to rely on Nick Foles. We have quality running backs. We have a great running back in Jay Ajayi. If we can pound the ball, like I consistently say, over and over and over again, us being at home is huge. It is huge. We need to wrap up this first round bye because, in my opinion, Nick Foles, as a backup, can get us to the Super Bowl. He can. Because there is no team, there is no team in this playoff, in the NFC side, that scares me. The Minnesota Vikings have a quality defense, but guess what? They have a backup QB as well. They'd be coming into Philadelphia. We wouldn't have to go to Minnesota. Nick Foles has to take this time, has to take this opportunity to get ready. It starts with a shitty team in the New York Giants this Sunday. And yes, we are going to win that game. So that'll put us one game above where we need to be for, to get a first round by. I'm not concerned. I really am not. I love Carson Wentz with a passion. He's going to be one of the best QBs of all time. It's sad what happened. But me being an Eagles fan, I expect these things. I expect the worst shit possible to happen every single year. That's why I'm not as heartbroken as, he is, as these other fans because I've lived through years and years and years and years and years of heartbreak. Years. I knew something bad was going to happen. But we just got to move on. What are we going to do? We're still going to the playoffs. It's not like we're missing the playoffs. What are we going to do? Just lie down to these other teams? Get your heads out of your fucking asses, Eagles fans. Cheer for this team. Support this team. Because guess what? You might not like what I'm about to say, but Nick Foles can lead this team to the Super Bowl. He really can. I'm such a huge fan of Nick Foles. That 2013 season was so much fun to watch. This guy loves to be here. He performs better here. Did you see that clutch throw he made to Nelson Aguilar yesterday? Great throw, great catch. We were losing when Carson Wentz left the field. We were losing. Nick Foles, believe it or not, won that game for us. Believe it or not. So, you guys can, you guys can complain, bitch, moan all you want. I'm sitting here confident. I'm sitting here not shaking. I'm sitting here as an Eagles fan that deals with heartbreak year in and year out as one that thinks we could still do it. Because I love this team. This team has so much chemistry. And this team is, is like a band of brothers. They really are. They're going to win this one for Carson. Let's fucking do it. Say I'm in denial all you want. I'm not. This is the life as an Eagles fan. We have to carry on. Continue what we're doing. Get ready for the playoffs. We got to get Nick Foles ready for the playoffs. And that's all I'm going to say. Fly goes fly. Let's fucking get this shit done. It's going to be a little harder. It's going to be a little harder. But we can get it done. Win it for, win it for once, baby. Win it. I'm out. Bye.